pleasantly surprised at the reaction from you guys about our Tower of God reactions. Looks like we are in. Here's the game plan. Um, this one is exception. This one just happens because today there's no Mushoku Tensei on Sunday. But I'm expecting the schedule for Tower of God to be weekly release on Tuesdays. But then, obviously, it's going to be Tuesday, but then upload on Wednesday. But then we'll also do any news episode on top of that as well. And then we're going to do like a weekly Tower of God reactions until the end of this current anime season, which is going to happen in about like five weeks, right? And then there's going to be like a gap before we go into a new anime season, which is when Tower of God Season 2 happens. In that gap week, we will basically marathon the remaining episodes to be caught just in time. Regarding the actual content from last episode, pretty compelling. People are saying this is like the one piece of webtoons. And based on the amount of world building that they were trying to do and set up in episode one, I could believe it. There's a lot of things to really talk about. There's, there's so many things of like, are we stuck in a tower? Why can't we see the skies? We need to get to the top of the tower. And then what? We get granted a wish. Why the fuck is this Rachel girl? Are we simping so hard? Because Bam is obviously sees her as like a motherly figure. He basically like hatched out of the egg. And it's the first thing that he saw. And he's kind of dependent on her. She basically just left him to see like the stars. There's so many different characters. Why is there a fucking talking, walking fucking crocodile? Why is that blue haired dude so fucking smooth? The, the, why is that guy with that purple, you know, Adidas tracksuit got three different pairs? I'm not really sure, but it's looking like we have some sort of battle royale selection exam arc. Let's begin today's reaction. Not BAM! No! Basically, it's B A A M. Pam. Pam means night. Also means yoru, yoru Japanese night, B A A M. But I kind of, I kind of want to call him Bam. I don't know, saying Bam, <laughs> it, it's funny to me. What's going on, Bam? Yeah, and this is how you say Rachel. What do you mean Rahel? What did the C go, bitch? You removed the C and put a fucking dash in there, Rahel? Rachel, dude, <laughs> come on. Rahel, <laughs> She literally taught him how to read write. She just literally just like raised him as a kid. Honestly, because you left me, I say go fuck yourself. But Bam is probably gonna be like, I'm gonna protect you no matter what. I'm upset she left us, bro. It just feels like Bum is a dog, and she's petting a dog right now. This relationship isn't really love. I don't know, man. I feel like a pet right now. Oh, Mr. Crocodile! What? Bird? He's a human. Turtle? Black turtle? What? <laughs> Tur turtle? What do, you, what do you mean, turtle? Not crocodile, he's an alligator. I don't really know the difference, but why are we a turtle? Is he? <laughs> what about this dude? Yeah, he's just standing there. Oh, <laughs> okay, this anime does have chibi moments like this. Okay, Rag Wraith Razor. He's not an alligator. Tur are humans turtles to him? What the fuck you mean, turtle? Alright, Mr. Rack is pretty straightforward. Oh shit. It looks like blue haired kids already figure out like the secrets of this game and how we're getting controlled. Bye. <laughs> so, blue haired turtle shows up, says you're a walking allig talking alligator, and leaves. Blue haired guy is pretty interesting. He's definitely one of the most interesting characters so far. What's your name? <sighs> he obviously recognizes it, right? Yeah? <laughs> This is just comical at this point. That kick is actually pretty fucking strong if you can sweep his leg like that. 
die! Oh, and this guy was standing here the entire time, by the way. This dude just stood there the entire time. What the fuck is this thing? What? We hid behind the- Don Clan. This thing is a Don Clan thing. He helped us escape, kind of. Okay, thank you. He's very mild. Bro didn't even fucking move. Aww. Don't judge a book by its cover, huh? Oh! <laughs> Tell me this shit ain't gay! There's gotta be bomb coon. Bro, instead of like Rachel Bomb or like fucking bomb fucking Yuri, like people probably ship these two together way more, right? Yeah, yeah, Yuri gave it. King Zahad. What the fuck? He's a navigator. So Yuri sits there and just like shits on Evan. And Evan's like, what the fuck, bro? But a lot of people uh, would kill to be in Evan's position to be insulted by this. <laughs> you know, Yuri. <laughs> Maybe he enjoys it. Maybe Evan's an M. That's right, he is a man, right? Only girls should have the sword. Yeah. Irregular, irregular. Are we trusting him too much? I don't know. I feel like I can't trust him. He feels very smart, but also at the same time. Are we getting manipulated? Ah, uh, Palm is like way too innocent and pure. Oh, this is the swordsman guy. Well, she has the princess blade. Potentially my favorite character has shown up. Potentially my favorite character. I don't know what he's about. I only am glazing him up because he seems so average compared to everyone else and has three copies of the fucking same, you know, clothing. He's got the Adidas jacket, so we'll see. Okay! Running away is something you do from those who are stronger than yourself. I don't think that you're stronger. Really? Against the Princess Zahad sword? You think that you can do it? Our what does Mr. Tracksuit fight with? Like, what does Mr. Tracksuit do? Can you keep up with these dudes? Like, like, I don't know. Or if, is Mr. Tracksuit just an NPC? <laughs> Shine! Get the fuck out of my face. 68 must be called. We'll just wait it out. Not really, no. Probably not. Why doesn't he have any memories? When he like got picked up by Rachel. All the stuff behind. Like why was he even in the fucking underground? Like what the fuck? He was just like beneath a bunch of rubbles and then she just found him? Yeah. Rachel. I blocked. Or like her pet, her possession. You impose your own rules. The way Kun approaches things and things is so interesting different in the beginning he was already defiant above the rules and like yeah let's not get control to you know see if we can fight each other and get down to 200 he operates in a totally different different context kun basically saw the zaha's sword and was like shit he seems fucking important let me let me let me get, me get close to him そういう意味では、ラークさんの方が。受け出す<笑> What's up, guys? I'm in here. I'm here, too. He just seems to be like a gag character. They're just like, you're ignoring me? I mean, yeah. It's like a 
Like, look at you and look at them! You look like the most average, like, fodder background character in a webtoon wearing a tracksuit while there's these dudes with, like, fancy dresses and, you know, clothing and swords and... We'll see about him. Second test. Oh, that guy's got wings. <laughs> Dude, he survived by sleeping? Holy shit! Because, like, there was, like, 400 dudes before. And you gotta wait till 200. And he just slept through the entire thing? <laughs> okay, he might be one of my favorite characters, too. I... Usually, I like side-supporting characters that's, like, interesting and funny and just weird. And, like, sleeping bag and tracks kind of catches my attention. Us three right over here. This is a trio. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Tracksuit got so fucking lucky. If he actually gets to team up with that princess girl and this dude. Dude, he's, he's just leeching. He's just like, uh-huh, I see my way. My bus ticket to the top. Let's go. <laughs> Ignored. <laughs> Ignored. <laughs> he didn't even get to say his name. She what? She what? <laughs> Shibisu. Shibisu, huh? Um, I am... I don't know. I enjoy him. He's like so different from everyone else. Because he just seems like he's... Like... <laughs> He doesn't look like he's supposed to belong here. You know what I mean? Everyone else here, it looks like they exist in the world of Tower of God. <laughs> Shibisu looks like an isekai character. Straight up! This dude literally is an isekai character in Tower of God. Rat! Rat, join us! Could he kill? He sees the potential in Black March. Really? Okay. Black March? What the fuck is this? What are you doing? Because Mr. Rack won't fight. It's not a worthy hunt if the weapon's not there. So we'll just stall and then he gets dragged into our team. Climb together! Wait, 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 okay, but he's good, he's good. That's like a bunch of kids in a jungle gym playground. <laughs> Looks like Rock Wraith Razor is fucking babysitting with a bunch of kids. Turtle Gang! Evan kills Mothership. Yo, what are these characters, man? <laughs> the one that stands out the most is the motherfucker that's not even standing up. <laughs> He's just still sleeping. He's straight up just sleeping. How did he get a team? Because those two girls, right? The girl with the horn, the girl that came out of the fucking bushes, saw the guy sleeping, and they're like, let's just fucking take him. Bald? Uh, is there anyone interesting? There's this big black blob of thing. I don't know what this dude's all about. What the fuck kind of eyes are these? He's got four eyes? This is like a bird? All these different designs, bro. Show off. And Tracksuit made it in. Tracksuit Shibi Shibiyo? You're right. Everyone would notice, right? That's an actual fucking boxer. Bro has actual boxing gloves on. <laughs> what the fuck? Is this an Easter egg? Just a random fucking funny picture? Or he's a boxer? Okay. No, I think we already fooled you. Yo, what is, how many, what, what does this bag have? Does he just pulls anything out of his fucking bag? Have a Snickers, chill the fuck out. Just Snickers. Are we gonna tame this alligator through these chocolate bars, bro? We're straight up gonna tame him with chocolate bars, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I 
He's talking big, bro. Bro is talking huge right now without doing anything. Should we be grateful? I hope he is as good as he talks. Man, he's hyping himself up. Oh, what was this? What was this? What was this? What was this? <laughs> this is the guy from Tekken. What's that? What's, what's that Chinese dude from Tekken? The one that owns a restaurant? Uh, he does backflips and shit. It's a kicks, bro. Fucking, it's not Bruce Lee, but there's a specific guy from Tekken that also does that kind of thing. Also, maybe that is the Bruce Lee pose. Anyways, maybe he's like a martial artist. Um, the moves here. Maybe he can fight. Killing arts. Killing arts, really? Law? You're right. Law. Hmm? What happened to your arm? Not me? <laughs> How many chocolate bars does he have? Look at the chocolate bars, bro! He has so many in his bag! Leroro sounds like Nanami from Jujutsu Kaisen. Ranker? What's a ranker? Rank? It stopped everyone but the mighty Rack Wraith Razor. You think Rack gives a fuck if a Ranker is in the room? Bro's too busy eating his Snickers. The actual top of the tower. Are you serious? Like, the top of the tower. The goal where everyone wants to go to. If you get there, you're a god. This dude did that? Really? Oh, okay. So he really did reach the top of the tower where King Zahad was. Holy shit. This guy's like, he's done everything that Rachel wanted to do. Yuri. I I is Yuri a ranker? I mean, she's from the Zahad family. If the family fucking lives up there, then she already got spawn point up there anyways. Let's cut it down to a hundred. <laughs> what is it this time? <laughs> Summon water out of nowhere and now sleeping bag of time I have to wake up. <laughs> Kevin Penkin's soundtrack going crazy! Shinsu is the source of the tower's power. What is Shinsu gonna be some kind of like mana system in this game? Like key? Chakra, like fucking Reiatsu, Shinsu is like the mana system of this. Water is the mana in this show. Shinsu is. Okay. Skill issue then? So if one motherfucker fails, the rest of your team fails. I can totally see the um the the green princess jihad and um the sword dude passing but what about tracksuit is tracksuit gonna be able to cross this I, I, how does this gonna work what you need most to climb this tower is luck basically get lucky um okay yeah what about sleeping bag guy he, somebody needs to wake him up <laughs> Good friends. Well, Tracksuit is kind of lucky, right? He, he, he was lucky enough to be, you know, teaming up with like really OP people. So, okay. What the fuck? Why is he here? We were just talking about the problem is bomb. And then he passed without even doing it. Because the water is supposed to push everyone back. There's some resistance. The water didn't push him back. Why? Irregular. <laughs> that defeats the purpose, dude. He passed. Was it lucky though? Or is he literally so built different that the Shinsu didn't even like resist him? It just passed through him because he is an irregular? Whatever the fuck that means. My black turtle. <laughs> Rack is glazing him. That was not luck. Leroro, the ranker, the man that climbed to the top of the tower says, a monster has arrived. Yo, the amount of hype right now that's building up to this irregular bomb. Holy shit, dude. A monster has arrived, says the administrator of this fucking test. <laughs> 
Tracksuit, come on, Shimizu, bro, you can do this, please, don't get, please, you need to make it through an extra round, I need you to pass, bro, also, this guy has a fucking horn sticking at the back of his head, how does he even sleep? A bet? Huh? I hope that Kun moves through, um, Rack Wraith Razor, maybe? Uh, who else was really promising talent? The Green Princess Zahad, the sword guy. A sleeping bag dude, he's interesting because he just doesn't really give a fuck. I want Kun to make it through next. Also, where the fuck is Rachel? Wait, 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 wait. Where where should Rachel not be in here? Wait, 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 what what the fuck? Wait, 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 200 people. In in, in the first exam, I just forgot. I'm like, wait, Rachel is also here supposed to be. What what, what, what the fuck? What the fuck? Where is Rachel? She wearing a disguise? There was a lot of hooded figures and masks, so maybe Rachel's wearing a disguise? I thought she was here already! Mm, the other Zahad princess. The intuition, bro. She's glowing. Instinct, we just scanned her and then she was glowing. What do you mean? Look at her. She's, she's the one, bro. This is a hot princess. What about the sword guy? Huh? Easy! Tracksuit. If you don't pass, they don't pass. He has to make it through, right? There's no shot Tracksuit gets left behind here. Hmm? Give me my memories. Who am I? Why the fuck was I hidden behind rubbles? Why did Rachel leave me? I have so many fucking questions. Why am I an irregular? How was I able to open that gate just through the fucking emotional burst after Rachel leaving was enough? Wait, 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 what was that? Yeah, that's a good question. That's a good question. Irregulars. Yeah, we forced the gate to open. <laughs> Fuck, I gotta focus. Genius is making me laugh. No, this is an important plot. This is an important plot. The tower is split into three separate sections. Residential district, which I'm assuming is where Rachel and Bam was before this. Only by a regular. Middle layer. She's talking bad shit. This, this bitch talking bad shit. Okay, you better be able to fucking pass this too. Alright, alright. Weaklings like you. Oh, oh. Sure? Let's see it. <laughs> she kept walking. The blood is falling down her face. The chosen ones like me. I'm supposed to be chosen to climb this tower. <laughs> Honestly, these two could be a funny ship. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> what the fuck is that face? <laughs> okay. But we're not. We were outside the tower. Well, no, 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 no. The tower is split into three sections. We're from the residential district. Or we're not from the residential district. Because no, the, the gate opening, that, that is the entrance to the tower. My bad, my bad. Because like, what was that gate really opening into? I thought that it's opening into the middle, like inner layer. So we're like out of the tower. Wait, what? So we were literally outside the tower. Where the fuck were we, dude? Another world? We're isekai characters now? Yeah! Old hag? Oh. He's up. He, he's up. He's up! Sleeping bag got up after yawning! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he's important. He skipped the entire first selection exam by sleeping. The second one, he just got up and walked past and decided, I'm tired. I'm gonna go to bed right in front of this Shinsu wall that you can't even fucking, you know, pass through this. <laughs> what the fuck? 
We're so strong that what? Did he just shoot a gun? <laughs> Did he just shoot a gun at the Shinsu? <laughs> Let her go. Shut him up. Oh, he bro is talking mad shit. Okay, let it Oh, this is gonna be good. You fuck him up. Let's see it. One last mess. Can you withstand the Shinsu pressure? Concentration is Shinsu gets stronger as you climb floors. It's not really made in the abyss, but think of it like if you descend layers, there's some kind of pressure. Uh, well, it's like a terrible example. There's a pressure you only feel if you climb back up. But basically, the tower, there's like this Shinsu atmosphere level mana, magicule, fucking Reiatsu pressure. And you need to withstand this if you're on the 30th floor. Damn! You were simply not chosen! That is humiliating. <laughs> Skill issue. Get lucky, bro. That's your problem. Goodbye. <laughs> the gods are cruel and you might be even crueler, bro. But he did say, right? You got to be lucky. In the Shinsu, like, you either have... Are you, are you just born with it? Like, Bomb just seems to have innate, like, Shinsu resistance. Like, like, the fact that the wall didn't even push him back, he didn't even fucking know. The other people that were able to cross it, they are already familiar with using Shinsu, or is this just like innate natural talent? I'm gonna assume that this is innate natural talent and a lot of people don't really understand the concept of Shinsu. Maybe they've heard of it, but maybe they haven't really trained it. I don't know. But this feels like a culling by just imposing such a cruel test where you're either lucky, as in, you were born with this talent, or you're not. <laughs> He's actually bleeding out his head. Also! He stopped, he, when we asked him about the Irregulars, we, we asked, like, are Irregulars bad? And then he was, Letter was like, no, not really. It's just that every time an Irregular has, you know, entered. And then he stopped talking because that guy shot the fucking gun. What happens when the Irregulars showed up? What, 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 what happens? Kun, you can pass it, right? Kun, please. Kun, you can do it. Do it! Easy. Easy, nice, nice, nice. Wait, 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 oh, wait. the black, the bag? What's in the bag? Wait, 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 was that like hinting at something? This feels important. Something in the bag? Is it all the chocolate bars? Like, what's going on? It was like, nah, I don't really want to go. There's something in there that's important that's, you know, doing this though. Important point to remember. Yeah, and this time, why don't you fucking answer our questions about irregulars, bro? What the fuck? Don't get too close to Kun? Why? He does seem a little bit too convenient. And he did only pair up with us because he sees potential in Bum. Well, not really Bum, but maybe just the sword and why he has a sword. Don't get close to Kun. Is he a friend? Is he an ally? Are we getting betrayed? Hmm. You can do it! Oh, she's doing it too, dude! Let's go! <laughs> These two, dude! I got more excited over these two average, you know, NPC looking characters get through than everyone else. I don't know, it's the struggle of the average and overcoming, and that's compelling to me, man. Is this a ship? The old hag and this fucking boomer? Is, is, is this a ship, bro? It feels like they are kind of destined. I don't know. They like passed at the same time. Wait, oh, oh. He was awake the entire time. <laughs> Shut up. He actually said something. Where's Rachel? Did he already pass all this? Are we in different tests? Hmm? Let her said, be scared. Wait, wait. Kun Agero Agnes. That's just full name. If you're gonna show me a character in this kind of background, like, you, you, you gotta, he's gotta be super important. I think we saw him in the trailer, but. I thought that he was going to be one of like the testing ad admins, but Leroy is, what is this? Maybe he's like the overall like director. Because like, I don't, is he, it, 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 does he run this entire like entries exam shit? Like what is this? Agero Agnisto, important name to remember. That is today's episode. Oh, Tower of God is scratching that itch that I just always have. 
when I'm I I always love these shows where it's like tournament arcs or like entrance exams, multiple people in a cohort, you know, looking for which kind of characters are really hype and stuff like that. Like, oh, bro, and they're fucking introducing to us like the the mana system of this world, which is Shinsu, and and like. Kun is supposed to be not trusted, and they've got all these other characters, the Irregulars, Leroro, he's already a ranker, why did the fucking Zod Princess give us the sword, like, god damn, this, this is fucking great, oh my god, and yes, this episode's going up a little bit early, because it's an exception, remember, we're going to be doing weekly releases roughly on Tuesday, Wednesday is, so look forward to that, we're getting into test three, which says the red door, Maybe that guy that was, you know, it, it, he he did seem to be around, surrounded by red doors, right? At, at the end here. I don't know. Maybe the background was just red. I mean, there's there's a bunch of red doors here. So may, maybe he's going to be the next test that been. I don't really know, but that's it for me. If you're still here. If you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time. Take care.